Uh, is it all right if I sing for you real quick? Well, she wants to watch a movie on a Friday night. And I want to sit close to her, so I say, well, hey, all right. And she pulls out the movie. I ask, what are we going to watch tonight? And she said, Pride and Prejudice. <laughs> and I cried. And I guess that's why they say every girl loves Jane Austen. Just like every girl loves Twilight and Zac Efron. And I want girls to like me, but I'm not a vampire, and I don't like dancing. Well, every girl loves Jane Austen. Yes, she does, yeah. Well, this movie has no action. There is no real comedy. But she snuggles up so nice and close and asks, what do I think? Well, I think that she's cool and she's beautiful. So what I said, I hope she understood. I said, really, this movie, it isn't that bad. It's just so far from good. And I said, every girl loves Jane Austen. Just like every boy hated Ricky Martin. And just like everyone over 40 seems to like to listen to Neil Diamond. Well, every girl loves Jane Austen. And though it's been two hours now, she says we're still far from the end. I'm trying hard not to sleep through the ending, because if I do, she'll make me watch it again. She'll make me watch it again. Well. We both sat close together the next Friday night. But this time I chose the movie with a vengeance inside. Well, there's no plot and they can't act and the English isn't overdubbed right. But all the actors, they know karate, that's what I like. And I guess that's why they say every boy loves Jackie Chan. Just like every other car in Utah is a minivan. And just like everyone here loves Fable Haven. I tried to make it work. Every boy loves Jackie Chan. Well, every girl loves Jane Austen. Every boy loves Jackie Chan. But if you put the two in the same room, well, who do you think's gonna win? Every boy loves Jackie Chan. <laughs>